Okay, on this video I'll show you how to get rid of the alertredirect.com annoying, annoying site. I'm just going to go and go to the page, see what happens. Um, it says alert-redirect.com and this was the page I'd been to and they make up a fake uh, scan warning thing. So it's a pop-up that's come from another website that I was on and you get this crazy annoying sound because it pops up below your window they're paying for this advertising now on this uh, let's see if we can get the sound to stop probably not <laughs> okay now what happens here is you can't close this window because it's got this pop-up I'm in Google Chrome you can't close this window because this pop-up is here you can't do anything. You can click around, nothing happens. You can click OK. You can say leave this page and it doesn't. And it comes back straight to the same page. So let's try and get the sound. See, we can't move away from this. Now, I've got a solution for this. But what I want to do first of all though is just show you the fun of, uh, they've given this number now. It's probably different in different countries, but this is a UK free phone number. And when you call this free phone number, it gets redirected. You can tell by the dial tone, it gets getting redirected internationally. And it's basically going to India. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to call this number now through my Skype. I wouldn't recommend using a real phone number on this because what they do is then they then call you back. But um, let's just go and show this as an example. So I'm calling the number now. We'll have a little bit of fun with the um, personal answers at the other end. Thank you for calling support, man. My name is Jack Brown. How may I help you? Hiya, Jack. Um, yeah, my car's not working. I'm so sorry. Can you repeat that? My car, the engine's not working. What, what, how can, you, can you help me? I've called the number on my, on my rescue card. Okay, sure, not a problem. You're having trouble with uh, car. your my car, my car? car? Yeah, my car's not working. Your car, um, sir, I believe it's the wrong number because uh, we are technical support for computers. Oh, oh, for computers? Yes, sir. Oh, right. What, what do you do? Well, uh, right now you're with support man. We are affiliated in Microsoft Certified Techs. I mean, if you're having trouble with your computer, I can fix that up for you. Oh, but, no, no. unfortunately, not a car. Yeah, okay. No worries. Thanks a lot. You're welcome. Is there anything else? No, if you, if you can't fix the cars, no need. Thanks a lot. <laughs> You're welcome. Take care. Bye-bye. Bye. So, very friendly. Bit of fun with them. But basically, they're given this fake thing that they're technical support, Microsoft certified. What a load of rubbish. Um, if we now call the same number again, and I won't say anything, they come up with a standard answer here, which says, um, well, I'll let you hear. got so many callers that they can't put through. Let's stop that, let's try again. This time I won't say anything. Thank you for calling support, man. My name is Jack Brown. How may I help you? If you can hear my voice, press tar or pound key. As I'm not able to hear your voice, I'm authorized to release the line. But you can always call us back again. Have a great day. Bye bye. And there they were. So they say well call you back because if you do a caller ID they end up calling you back anyway that's by the by so don't uh, don't get um
caught by calling the phone number on here, Norton by Semantic, big red screen, big red cross, everything like that. You're thinking, how do you close this? I can't close Chrome. A uh, very simple solution for this is to press Control, C T R L and W at the same time. Now you're going to have to go through a few. Um, what you want to do is press Carriage Return first of all to get rid of the um, notification here on the page where it says leave this page and we press Control w very quickly at the same time Whoop. we're going to back to Skype <laughs> right let's leave the page right. Control w and we're out and there you go and that's how you get rid of it um, but I'd imagine that's very alarming for people and very scary as well but whatever you do don't call that number and start getting involved in dialogue they'll be after you for money they'll be asking access to your computer they'll wreck your computer they'll do all sorts of things so don't do that i hope that's been useful for you thanks for watching